everybody, welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be making a Christmas holiday let's play. We're starting it today. It's going to be kind of like either a rags to riches or a restoration to riches, essentially where we'll be like rebuilding a house. And here is my lovely plot. We're making a flippin' Hallmark movie let's play, baby. Okay, we got our... We, I mean, I haven't built her yet. Okay, so this is just this is just a randomized sim, but I just thought she was pretty, so I stopped here. But we're gonna make a randomized sim. She's a big city gal who came from the city um, to a small, cozy Christmas town where she's going to have to essentially go from rags to riches or rebuild a, a place and save the town and have Christmas and fall in love. That is the let's play, okay? So we're a big city gal moving to the, moving to a small town to learn the true meaning of Christmas. It's a let's play, baby, okay? So that's what we're doing. <laughs> it's gonna be fun, it's gonna be rags to riches, it's gonna be romance, it's gonna be cheese. It's gonna remind you a lot of my other rags to riches let's play that was plot heavy. That was, of course, the fantasy, um, uh, uh, I think it was fantasy princess? Was it, it was something like fantasy fairy tale, fairy tale rags to riches, I believe, is what that one was. This one is a holiday theme. Does she fall in love with a farmer boy or a farmer girl? Quite possibly. The, you know, I think you guys should make the love interests. Um, at home and then I'll download them in episode two, which will probably be Sunday. Um, so make make some love interests, make some fun c characters, make like the the woman that like owns the cookie shop and like make the the person that owns like the ice cream store that's struggling because it's it's cold outside. Like make the whole fun, make like the mother figure and the that's like all wise and like, oh, why don't you go after this person? You know that you love them. Uh, make the the stray dog that needs a home. Make all of it, make all, the annoying best friend that calls from the city like, hey girl, when are you coming home? Or like your, her boss that's like, you're gonna need this deadline. And then she's like, I don't need to do the deadline, I quit. Any character that you'd be into making for this story, build them in the Sims and we'll we'll download them on, on Sunday. Uh, and, and yeah, but today we're gonna just start with our main character, setting her up in whatever the town is gonna be. Um, and uh, Christmasing the crap out of it. Holidaying the crap out of it. Um, it's kind of non-denominational. Can we use CC too? You can use CC, just know that if you use CC that I don't have, uh, I'll have to replace it. But other than that, go ham. So that's what we're doing here today. I think it's gonna be a fun Let's Play uh, invented by yours truly, although it's kind of inspired by the restoration. I think it's called like Rags to Restoration or the Restoration to Riches um, by uh, J James Turner. I believe he did that. Or maybe it was Deligracy. It was one of two or both. Um, what hashtag? Great, we need a hashtag. Okay, we'll do Kelsey Christmas. Hashtag Kelsey Christmas. <laughs> Can her name be Holly? So many of you guys are like, her name has to be Holly. It might be, her name might be Holly. But let's jump in to build, it was Deli. Okay, it was Deli. Thank you for correcting me. Deligracy did this challenge um, in, in, in a, I'm not gonna do the exact same thing, but I'm gonna do something similar. We're gonna take off the, the leg hair. Not that there's anything wrong with leg hair. I just feel like she's a, she's a good businesswoman from, a, from the city. She's not gonna have like leg hair. So she might have, she's gotta look like the every girl that you would see in a Hallmark movie. So we're gonna have, you know, her just look very, very pretty, you know, pr big pretty eyes. I actually kind of like these eyes. Um, big pretty eyes, like just a pretty, a pretty girl that just needs to learn the meaning of Christmas. Um, I kind of want her to have a more prominent nose just for fun. A, a kind of maybe that it's not that's not super pro there we go pretty i love it i love it i love it oh now it's looking flat there we go i just i'm like where what's happening here there we go trying to there we have it baby Ah, uh, nice. Okay, come back, come back. 
Yes, I love that nose. Okay. Woo. No, 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 no. We're good. We're good. Pretty. Okay. Excellent. All right. Let's uh, let's remove <clears throat> these EA lashes. Go in with some new ones. Boop ba doop boop bam. I don't know how I'm feeling about these these eyebrows on her. Maybe we could do a different. Yeah, that one's kind of nice. I actually kind of like this one on her. Name her Holly or Noel. <laughs> Prominent nose gang, exactly. Prominent nose game gang represents. She got it. We're also gonna do like a nice little full pouty lip for our beautiful pouty lip queens. I, I, I was not lucky enough to have them, so I'm gonna give them to my Sims. I think she's looking gorgeous. Okay, and then we'll do some fun, some fun like, oh no, what's happening? Want some fun like, looking at all the, oh, that one's beautiful on her. This like lemonade one. So I think I'm gonna do the lemonade. We're gonna give her like lots of lashes. I think I'm gonna go with this one. Actually, yeah, that one, that one's nice. <clears throat> I also wanna give her a bit of blush, almost like she's always out in the cold. You know, like, you know how it's like, you're always out in the cold, so you just have your face is kind of flushed. I want that. <laughs> you like the bigger lashes? You want them even bigger than this? We can go bigger. All right, let me see. Oh, those are nice. Just the upper lashes. I don't like just the upper lashes on the Sims. Let's do those. Those are nice. We'll do that. This one's kind of seems like an in-between, the more dramatic ones in them. I also feel like these lips are not... There we go. I was like, they're not quite as large as I was anticipating. There we go. She's beautiful. We'll give her, we'll give her, make a little, a little bit more curvy here. Maybe a little bit more, and then we'll make her quite fit. I saw someone say fit and plus size. I think that would be a fun body type that I haven't um, had on the, in my let's plays yet. So let's go for it. So she'll be like a curvy queen. Get that, oh, she got the booty. She got the booty for days. Get the, yes, girl. Yes, girl. But she fit, she fit. She's a fit queen. She toned. You want her to have a, a like a, a cleft chin? I guess I haven't had a little cleft chin moment. Cleft chins are hard. Oh, I can't see it because of my, um, I can't see it because of my uh, skin details. So we won't do cleft chin this time, I'm sorry. Bigger thighs to match the rest of the bot. I think they are bigger, but we can we can go even bigger. Honestly, in The Sims, the thighs never look all that big. Like the, the arms and thighs, like you could max them out and I still don't think that's big. You know? I think she looks great. She has the booty I never had. She's the booty I've always wanted. Like, like dang. Okay, wait, we want, wait, she's gotta have like pretty good posture. Cause she's, she's from the city, okay? She holds herself to a high standard. All right, let's give her some makeup really quick before we jump in. To, actually, we'll do makeup last. Cause I like to do makeup based off of the like look. All right, so she's like a little business girl. So I feel like she'll do like a set like this. Like this just looks like, but well, obviously it's winter. So she's gonna have to do kind of a more, but I just see her being like a businessy. That's a little too casual for her, honestly. It's, it's not put together enough. This is kind of what I'm going for, but I don't like it. Maybe this. <clears throat> okay, I don't like any of these. We're gonna do top and bottom. We're gonna do top and bottom. We'll do like a blouse or like a button up. She's 
She's got to be buttoned up. Let's maybe go blouse. I want her to look like she's from the city. A city woman. This one might work. Still looks a little casual, though. Because then I want her clothes to change once she, like, you know, fits into the crowd or fits into the, the small town life. She, like, fi finally decides that she likes it or whatever. There we go. This looks great. We'll give her like, ooh, should we give her like a little pencil skirt kind of vibe? Like one of these kind of looks? It is pretty cute. It's a cute look. Okay. Chewie likes it. Isn't that right, Chew? Oh yeah. Exactly, Chewie. Na -na 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 -na. Okay, here we go. Here it is. This is kind of what I was looking for. Then we can do the button-up shirt. We'll maybe need to get a color. Yeah, this is kind of what I had in mind. And then we'll do like a high, high heel. Yes, yes. The high, high heels that get like stuck in the snow as she's walking. <laughs> she's like walking through the snow and her heels keep getting stuck. And she's just like, what the heck? And then she also has like awesome nails. The girl has great nails that are clearly just like to the nines. These nails are done, done to God. Nice and shiny too. Maybe she'll have like a red nail. It is, oh no, you know what? I kind of like the black and white. Kind of like the black and white look. We can change her hair too, but I do like the kind of slick straight kind of energy. Oh, should we do some like little tights underneath? Some like little little tight moment. Like this almost. But I would want them like more nude. Ew, those are not cute. Maybe we won't do tights. I thought that they'd be cute. I don't I don't think so anymore. She reminds me of the proposal. She's a babe. A slicked back bun. Ooh, perfect idea. Perfect idea is the slicked back bun. You're correct. That's exactly what she needs. Or like a really blunt bob. But no, I will do the slicked back bun. The slicked back bun. Where is the slicked back bun that we can do? This. Yep. <laughs> oh, she's she's pretty. I like her a lot. Okay. Let's give her like a fun lip. I just feel like she deserves a nice lip. Cause look at her lips. Like these are beautiful lips. She, she, she should, she shouldn't like give them, give them a bit of a show. She should give everyone a show with these lips. Okay, wait, where's like the reds? There we go. I think this one was pretty on her. There we go. We get like a little, little nice sneaky earring moment. Okay. Ooh, I guess pearls would make sense. What is this music going on? A glossy lip? Do you want it glossier than this? She's giving JLo. I love that. Oh my God. Reminds me of Professor McGonagall. <laughs> wow. Is it just the, is it just the hair? Red looks amazing on her. She looks gorgeous. She's beautiful. Oh my gosh, she's stunning. The woman's is stunning. I look away for two seconds to change thread and she looks so good. Thank you, Braze World. We are artists out here. She looks, she's given lawyer vibes or chef. I do like the high powered lawyer. But that, I think it's like she accidentally inherited a family house and she got like fired or something. She, you think she needs green eyes? All right, we can go for green eyes. I do love a brown eye, I'm not gonna lie, but I haven't had a character with green eyes, I think in a minute. Ooh, maybe we'll do like the greeny, like like the greeny gold, this like color. Oh, it's so pretty. Or like these ones. I think I'm gonna go with this one, this like green gold kind of looking. It's pretty. No, the caramel eyes were so dreamy. Laid off because the company was going under. Ooh, interesting, yeah. Or we could do like these, yeah, the nice like caramel. Hmm. The green are pretty. I think it's because 
I like it because it's Christmassy. So I think we'll keep the green because it is pretty Christmassy. But let it be said that I love, I'm a sucker for brown eyes. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a sucker for some brown eyes. I'm just, you know, I have blue eyes, so I've always found blue eyes boring. I don't know why. I think it's just, you always like what you don't have. Uh, the green because it stunned me. The green are gorgeous too. A pair of green eyes are also very pretty. A pantsuit. Yeah, we can also do that. Maybe a, a second uh, outfit. We'll do a pantsuit. But actually, I kind of like this look. Let's do our formal look. Oh, this is not it. The formal look. I mean, I don't, I don't hate it, um, the formal look that she's got, but I do feel like she would dress in her formal wear. I think she would dress very, oh my God, this is going to be the formal wear at the end of the series. Imagine this is like the thing she wears at the end when she's like, <laughs> but we're not there yet. We're not there yet. She doesn't get to show up to the Christmas ball in the, in the gown to, to tell her, oh, oh wait, she's got to wear that. Hold on. Hold on. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Excuse you. Excuse me. Where did that go? Where did that go? Where did it go? I need that outfit. Where did it go? Chewy, where did it go? I need her to wear that every day as well as some, some days. Is it, shoot. It's not overalls, outer, it's not outerwear. It's not sets. Maybe, I don't know. Where was that? I lost it. Okay, hold on. I'm pretty sure it's from the, not the, not you, Wedding Stories. From Wedding Stories. There it is. Boom. For those who wanted a pantsuit. There you have it. She's in it. Okay, but for her formal wear, I think she would go just like very... Something like this, or even like more covered up. This is her to begin with when she first starts, starts out. So it's not, it's not really indicative of her later. Okay, we're gonna take off what my wedding stories though. Maybe something like, hmm. I just want it to be like a very straightforward, but pretty gown. Maybe like this. This just this is giving I'm from a big city. That's what that's giving to me. So we're gonna do that. It's not very straightforward. It's actually quite, quite fun. But we like a little edgy moment. A little black heel. What's the name of the custom eye color mod that you have? I honestly don't know. Um <laughs> It's gotta be in my on my CC master list. So go maybe go through that and you'll um, find it. I think it'll probably be under makeup is my guess. Um, if that helps track it down and narrow it down for you. I'm sorry that I can't help further. If any of you guys know what it is, she is giving JLo from Made in Manhattan. And I, I really like that actually. I'm, I'm, I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan. This definitely looks like, like a little bit of, uh, she, she does tennis in her free time. And I, I, I think she does do tennis in her free time. <laughs> Give her a little socks, like itty bitty little socks. I do tennis in my free time. Hot Santa, and then she marries Santa. No, she doesn't, she can't, you know, don't make me marry Santa again. I can't, I can't bear it. I can't do that again. Oh, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome new friends. Okay, pajamas. Welcome. Welcome everybody. We're doing our, if you're just tuning in, we're doing, we're getting ready for our Rags to Riches Hallmark Christmas Movie Edition. We're making our big city gal right now. I think maybe she would go into like, into this kind of a robe. I think this is the kind of robe she wears to bed. She wears her like puffy robe, or maybe she does like this kind of thing. I don't know. I could see her rocking something like that. But these are also very cute. Or this, like a button down shirt. I guess we'll have her hair down when she goes to bed. I wish there was a more Christmassy color. The blue is pretty though. We'll, we'll have her hair down when she goes to bed. Where's the like really slick? There we go. Yeah. 
This is her when she goes to bed. Great. Oh, also her nails need to still be done though. Just nails, nails for days. All right. Oh, and her nails need to be done when she's doing fitness as well. Because my nails are always done during fitness, okay? If you get your nails done, they're always done. They don't, you can't take them off for athleticism. This is a cute dress for party, but I don't think that she would wear this for her party look. I think she's gonna look, she needs to look like painfully put together in City Girl. Like this might be kind of good. I'm, I'm thinking she's from New York. Oh my God, this is great. But that's not at all what I had in mind. Maybe like this, like a pantsuit, but like a black one. That's great. This is perfect. I feel like I'm a stylist on a Hallmark movie and I'm like, this is exactly what that character would wear when we start the story. And then she and then she goes to her small town and eventually we give her a makeover. You guys can tell me which, which episode it is that she gets the makeover. A ponytail for fitness? Yeah. Yeah, I see that. We could do ponytail instead of bun. Where's where's the sleek ponytail? I feel like there I have a sleek pony and I don't I think it's like a high a sleek high pony. It's like an Ariana Grande version. Which is also a lot, but I think it'll be cute. Where is my sleek pony? Here we go. Mmm, that's too much, Kelsey. Let's see if there's a better sleek pony. Come on, sleek pony. Hmm. That's, that makes her hair short. Her hair's not short. Oh, that's cute with the braid, but it looks a little too poofy. It's almost like too chilled. I, I missed the, you know what? I like the bun still. I'm sorry, I'm boring, but we're also probably never gonna see her in that outfit. So that's part of it. All right, and then for, for swimwear, she's a, a big city gal. I feel like she'd just wear like a, a classic black top, black bottoms kind of girly. I don't think she'd be crazy. Megan, thank you so much for gifting subs to the community. <laughs> Christmas was her favorite holiday. Making waves is a paralegal in New York. Her boss took notice, too much notice. Oh no, her heart got broken on Christmas Eve. So she moves, runs away and tries to regain her love for Christmas with the help of a lo lovely local man who happens to be a community lawyer. <laughs> I think she's got a hardened heart. I don't think she got her heart broken recently. I think she, I think she's afraid of love. I think she did get her heart broken once though, for sure. But I think it's been long ago. And since then she's totally closed off. She's like, love isn't for me and F Christmas. Ooh, maybe she did get her heart broken on Christmas. So she's like, F Christmas. Christmas is lame and overdone and cheesy and boring. And she doesn't like Christmas anymore. Wow, two raids, look us go. Thank you so much. Raiders, welcome. I love it when you guys write like full, full uh, things on there. I love it. She was definitely engaged. Ooh, yeah, she was engaged. <gasps> oh no, they were engaged and she walked in on him with another person on Christmas Eve when she thought he was working late. <gasps> and he like kept making her feel bad because she loved Christmas. He's like, ah, Christmas is a stupid holiday. I'm gonna work on Christmas. And she's like, oh, okay. And then she's like, surprise, Christmas. I like brought Christmas to you. And he's sleeping with someone else at the office. While they're engaged, she takes her ring off and throws it in his face. It's like, F this. And then she just doesn't like Christmas after that. <laughs> Poor baby. I know she's just, she's just struggling out here. Okay. She's got to refine her love and passion for Christmas. That's what we're gonna, we're gonna bring it. It's gonna be fine. Okay. Oh, this is definitely like her hot weather look. She's like, I, this is, you know, cooler. My arms are out, okay? I am cool. And then she wears like fully heeled shoes, like just normal pumps. They're like, okay, yeah, you look super comfortable. She wears pumps in every outfit. 
Honestly though, I love that. I also feel like in her Hallmark story, she's not gonna lose her baddiness, okay? She's gonna stay a baddie. She's gonna be a, a different baddie. You describes how I feel about Christmas, but I've never had my heart broken on Christmas. <laughs> and I knew a lot of people have this feeling. You're like, I don't have a reason to feel this way. I just do feel this way. But I didn't, I didn't have a re I wasn't heartbroken on Christmas to feel this way. This is just who I am. You know, nothing but respect. Oh, we need, we need to give her like accessories on everything. I can't believe I, I dropped the ball on this. Really some little like little baby hoops. No, they're too fun. I want her to like constantly be like looking like old money here. Not that she, not that hoops, uh, not that these things aren't fun. I actually do think they're fun. I, I like her style personally. I like that kind of style. Like a polished New Yorker. I think it's gorgeous. There is no dislike. Oh my God, the Christmas sweater. Imagine like, like she didn't bring cold weather wear <laughs> and this was like in the closet and she's like, And she like shows up, she's like, this is the only, I didn't bring a coat. <laughs> ah, the idea that people wear color in New York. Some people do, but a lot don't, a lot don't. Oh my gosh, she could wear like some like cute pants. I love it. It's giving me Jennifer Lopez. She is giving a bit of Jennifer Lopez, I think. It was an accident, but she is giving it. Okay, but I want her to have like, not cold weather. I want her to have like the pencil skirt again <laughs> that she was wearing earlier. She just wears it twice. Where is it? Come on. Skirt, 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 skirt. Come on, skirt, 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 skirt. skirt. Okay. On all bottoms, custom content. We just want the custom, the CC skirt, little pencil skirt from Grimm. There it is. She just wears this. <laughs> hey now, hey, we New Yorkers love color. Exactly, I'm sure you do. I'm sure you love it. Okay, fantastic, she's gonna wear. Oh, this song's actually quite cute. This is quite cute. Really little black pumps. We'll give her out different outfits at some point, but this is just too funny. I can't not do this to her. I'm sorry. It's too funny. The The hashtag is Kelsey Christmas and make sure to uh, make all the fun characters of this Christmas town that she's going to end up in. Yeah. So it's like her normal clothes. It's this, it's this outfit, but with, with a sweater on, which is just hilarious to me that she had to put this on. She's like, mm, I don't like it. I'll put it, I'll, I'll make her have another cold weather look that doesn't have the sweater too, just for fun. But we do also need to give her her makeup back. I didn't, I forgot to give her her, her lip, her signature lipstick in all of her looks. I think it was like this one. Is it that one? No, it's darker. Ooh, that one's pretty though. Both of those are pretty. Oh my goodness. No. Which one is it? Is it this? No. Is it, no, it's not that. Is it this? No. Where did, which color is, which color are you? Which color are you? I want you again. Where are you? Oh, you're over there. Okay. I'll be back. Perfect. Oh, she's so cute. Okay. I gotta give her this look, the lip. I need to give her a lip also with all of her other looks. So hold on. We're going back to give her a nice, a nice lip. She deserves it with all of her looks. Th those lips, you got to be kidding. If I had lips like that, I would also be wearing lipstick always, always. You would never catch me without lips on. Oh my God. I'd be like showing off those things every day, every day. Shout out to all of you that have gorgeous lips like that. Oh my gosh, I'm so envious. 
I have massive lip envy. I have a friend, Olivia, she's the best lips. She's a literal lip model. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's so, so beautiful. Oh, this is good. This is like a good little, little mood for us. I think it's the wrong bottoms for this, for the outfit though. We're gonna have to unfortunately wear some like pants with this, I think. But this is a good, a good look for her, I think, for her cold weather look as well. Maybe the black on black. I know it's, I, I know I'm being boring by doing this, but I, I do not care. I wish I did, but I don't. I wish this was a clipping. Because this would look so cute together. Like, like, look how cute that is all together. Hmm. Maybe I could do this. This will work, but it's, it's like, it's too, uh. Hmm. It's too cropped. Mm, okay, we'll do this, but we just won't do these pants, unfortunately. We're just having to do a different pair of pants. All good. We'll do these. And then we'll do like a, a, a nice heeled boot. Wow, this music is like very... <laughs> Very slow paced. My dude, I need something a little bit more upbeat, okay? Give me something a little bit better than that. No, not that one. All right, let's, let's do this one again. We're starting from the top. There we go. She looks amazing. All right, we're gonna give her some nice, Red nails. Oh, I would give her a trench coat, but I don't think I have a trench coat. Do I have a trench coat? I don't think I do have a trench coat for The Sims. So this is this is it. Will you upload to the gallery when she's done? She's so gorgeous. I will. She has a lot of CC on her, so apologies in advance. But she looks great. We could also give her like an eyeshadow if we if we want. She doesn't really need it because she's just so pretty, but we could give her like a shimmery gold or I think she'll probably want it more of a silver, like a brown. I feel like a blue or something would go better with this look. Maybe like a one of these in a blue. She doesn't really need it. Maybe like a nude. Maybe we take this off. Yeah, she doesn't need it. It's too much. We're gilding the lily. Uh, okay. What is her name? Also me. Oh, I can't. We can't hear the gameplay. This whole time we couldn't hear it. Oh, the samba. Ruby. Kusara. Zuby <laughs> Web. Algarez Winkira. Juan Jeannie Larray. That's her voice. <laughs> oh my gosh. A lot of you have been saying Holly. Joy would be funny as well. All right, let's 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 do a poll. I'll let you all vote for her name. Name. Holly. Joy. Mm -hmm. Noel. Or... I don't like candy cane. I'm sorry. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say no to that one. I'm gonna do Holly, Joy, or Noel. <laughs> there we go. Those are the names. Those are the options. Holly <sighs> Berry. She could be the long lost relative of the berries. Do, 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 do. Oh, the Noels are winning. I really thought the Hollies would win, but the Noels are coming in hot. Hmm. I'm sorry, Candy Cane is very cute. It sounds a little, it doesn't sound super classy to me. I'm not saying it's not cute. I'm hmm. just saying, I feel like she's a high class lady and I think she should have a very high class lady name. And candy cane kind of sounds like you're maybe dancing on a candy cane, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I'm sorry! <laughs> the 
listen, I'm not saying Kane is not a good last name. It is a good last name, but it, I hope your name's not Candy Kane. <laughs> okay, Noelle is her name. Noelle, that's really cute. Okay, cute, cute. So her first name is Noelle. What's her last name? Ah. I'm sorry! <laughs> Uh, Candy Cane is her drag queen BFF. Somebody make Candy Cane the drag queen BFF. Can't Noel Holiday? <laughs> that would be Noel Kane. Noel Frost. Noel Winters. Ooh, Noel Winters. <laughs> that does sound like she's like a little bit of an ice queen, but then it's like very thematic. I love it. Noel Winters. Perfect. Noel Winters. She's an adult. She's not Holy a young adult. Nine She's a grown woman. Okay, Noel Winters. She's not a young adult. She's an adult. This is an adult story. All right. Her aspiration, huh. I feel like right now, she's going to change aspirations. But I feel like at the beginning, she wants to maybe be fabulously wealthy, get rich, have a successful career. Hmm. All right. Personality wise. She's self-assured. She's confident. Okay. She comes in hot or maybe she's hot headed. No, I don't mm. like dealing with my Sims being angry. <laughs> I don't like dealing with that. I feel like she probably, oh, but definitely a perfectionist. Huh. She'd be high maintenance. Oh, that's a good one. High maintenance. We'll definitely do that. Where's high maintenance again? Is it, I think it's gotta be this one. Cause this is the longest one. Overachiever. Where's high maintenance? Hello? I must be missing it. You guys are like, it was right there. It was right there. I knew oh. it. Uh, Perfect. Uh -huh. So she's high maintenance. She's a perfectionist. Um, I think ambitious would be good. Snob would be good. But I want to give her one that's kind of like, Aw, <laughs> I want to give her one quality. We could also remove perfectionist if we want to. But I want to give her one quality that's like, oh, that's what what makes her such a little softy. Maybe like her. Maybe she loves cats, or she loves. Um, maybe she's like a music lover. She loves music. I feel like music lover would be cute. Cause then if she loves music, then she could like sing all the Christmas carols. <laughs> Art lover, that would make sense. Art lover for the culture, nature lover, cat lover, music lover. I like music. I think I like music lover. And of course we get to see my, we might take uh -huh. out Cats. Uh, I feel like I, I, my like huh. not so berry has been yeah, very cat focused lately. So I think I'm gonna go not having a cat yet. I'm gonna let you guys decide what kind of pet. Cause I want it to be like a random pet from town that she might like adopt <laughs> or that adopts her, like walks into her home and won't leave. Oh my gosh, how, we are getting, this is our third raid today. I feel very lucky. Welcome raiders. Maybe she's a snob. Let's do snob. I feel like snob will see more. Like I wish perfectionist had more to do with everything. Like if you, Ugh. if your house is unclean, good you're like, ugh. Or like if you're, um, you don't make a really good salad, you'd be like, ugh. Like I wish perfectionist impacted way more than it does. I think perfectionist really only impacts crafting items. Yeah, it's just crafting. I'm like, I am a perfectionist. I never craft any items. You know why? Because I, I'm too pro for perfectionism to even try. <laughs> I like being a snob. I feel like, well, the snob thing will, and the, maybe the, I feel like the high maintenance or the snob might like dial back later. Um, But yeah, I love it. What do you guys think? Or she could be, or could she be self-assured? Squeamish would be funny. 
materialistic. I don't think she's materialistic. I think she just doesn't like like other things. I don't know. High maintenance makes is funny. Maybe non-committal would be good. And then and then she, she oh, I like that. Maybe non-committal oh, and then uh, it'll turn into like romantic. Uh, so she's like, I don't want that. I like that better. She's non-committal, and then when she meets the right person, she's gonna become like, wait, they're gonna, they're gonna, they're gonna like worm her, their way into her heart. I think that makes sense with the plot. Versus snob, I just feel like, like, okay, maybe she likes nice things. That doesn't make her a snob. <laughs> I may or may not be talking about me. I'm just saying, I want some justice for the for the New York woman, like power woman, okay? From these stories, all right? Some of us are single business women and aren't snobby, okay? And we still can like nice things. My dog apparently was like, I'm out. Rose Jen, she's not Rose Jen because she's not gonna serial date. She just doesn't like, she just doesn't like dating in general. All right, so this is Noelle Winters. We're gonna, uh, we'll have her likes and dislikes just for fun. We'll say activities. She does not like baking. Spotted Actually, no. Wombo. I don't want to give her too many Diola. likes and dislikes. Maybe we'll just have her not like Christmas music. That'll be funnier. We'll have her not like ho winter holiday music. Absolutely no. Oh, bomb. It'll make her cringe every oh. time. Uh, and then activities. Maybe she does. She does like singing. Huh. Uh, and maybe like piano. Huh. Uh -huh. And Garnet Pay. And then the rest of it will will kind of let it happen as it happens. I like I like having Sims that like fitness too. Silly. Because I like fitness. Yep. Barter Imbo. <laughs> Have the game choose the rest of her likes and dislikes for her. I agree. All right, so we're gonna upload her to the gallery. The main character of my Hallmark Christmas movie challenge. Okay, great. I'm gonna upload her to the gallery so you guys can have fun with her. You can switch it to confident. Maybe we'll do that with high maintenance later. But this is how she, this is Noel now. Lover or leaver. Noel Winters is ready to go. I wish you could have more than three trades. I agree. It'd be nice to have like even just four, you know, even just four trades would be kind of fun, you know? All right, it is winter, obviously. I'm also going to adjust the settings. Okay, so where do we move? Part of me thinks like Tartosa could be cute because it's all romantic, but it's supposed to be like a small town. Oh, you know what? We got to do Brindleton Bay. Oh my God, it's gotta be Brindleton Bay. It could be nowhere else. It could be nowhere else. <laughs> she moves into a little a little place in Brindleton Bay. It's gotta be, it's the most Christmassy small town looking thing I've ever seen. Okay, we're gonna maybe go on, which lot should we go on? These, all these are 30 by 20s. It's by the dog hospital in the dog park. That's so cute. I feel like we'll just do a 30 by 20 lot and then we'll download a, like a, a kind of like, eh. Or we could do this, this one, 40 by 30 and download a crappy house. It does give small town from Christmas movies. The lot on the island. Ooh, did this one? Well, there's someone in this lot. But that would be kind of fun. The island lot and she works. Well, this one's not livable. This is a location. You can't just fall. You can just move in there. She has to love the local vet. You guys get to choose. It would be really cute though. The local vet makes a lot of sense. Mm, goodbye to the person on that lot then. On this one? Okay. All right, we're gonna move her in right here just really fast. And then I'm gonna see the other ones. Get them out of the house. You're evicted. Local vet is very Shits Creek. Oh, I love Shits Creek. That's so Shits Creek, I love it. Okay. Oh my God, this overpass. 
Oh my god, look at it though. It's so giving Christmas movie vibes. I was right. Okay, should we do this house though? Let me go look at that one. This is perfect, 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 perfect. Star small since it's supposed to be Rex Riches. That's true. My problem was that I was gonna do like a dilapidated house, like a fixer upper, and she's supposed to renovate it, is more of the goal. Okay, let me. Where did I go? Brindles of Bay. All right. Oh my gosh, how many Sims live here? Oh, it's all the Degados. Okay, I'm going to evict you all anyway. I'm sorry. I'm sorry! I evicted them. You guys are gonna make my characters in my little small town anyway. All right, so here's the house. Oh, it's, a, it's very big. Let's see if there's any houses on the gallery. Fixer, upper. Okay. Let's see what houses on the gallery have. Oh, wow. We have a lot of redeemables that I have been uh, not paying attention to. RB Princess, thank you so much for giving a treat to Chew. Thank you for the reminder about the redeem, the point redeems. Oh, good boy, Chuba. Good job, Chew. Say thank you, RB Princess, for the treat. Uh, valid like a salad. Thank you so much for the stretch. Their Christmas present being a bit of fiction notice. Now, thank you so much for the stretch. I'm gonna stretch my neck. Oh. oh, that was a good one. Jazz, thank you so much for giving a treat to Chewy. Here you go, Chew. And I'll get to these other ones in a minute. All right, let me see these fixer uppers. Most popular. Yeah, we want like a neglected, like a bad fixer-upper kind of house. Oh, this one's kind of cute. Ooh. Oh, this one looks rough. Okay. I want to. I want the exterior. Oh, this one. This one looks wild. I want the exterior to be something I kind of like. Foreclosure. I love it. This one's kind of cute because it's like a little cottage. Or oh, this one is nice. I like this one, maybe. This one's a 30 by 20. So actually we could have, we didn't have to kick these people out of the house. But you guys can make up who lives there, okay? <laughs> okay. I'm gonna go back to her house. <sighs> it's just a little bit of a fixer up there. Let's start a, start a remix. Set a timer for one minute. Welcome to the remix. We're gonna put down our house. That's a fixer up the baby. I'm gonna do a little fixer up the wait, wait, this one's really cute. It's a little farmhouse, but it does it doesn't really look like a fixer upper to be honest. It looks just cute, so we will do this one. It's 38,000 simoleons. Okay, wait. We need money. 38000 simoleons. Oh, well, we accidentally finished her requirement. Oh. Wait. Oh, it's the one. Okay, hold on. Money. 39,000. There we go. We got another thousand. All right, now we can place it. Furnished. And then I'm going to see what it looks like. We might end up having to change it. Oh, oh it looks so cute. Wait, maybe I should have put BB move objects on. BB move objects on. Ba 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 da ba da ba. Oh, fixer upper, fixer upper, we're gonna put you down. We're gonna see a cute little fixer upper in town. I honestly don't think anything changed, but it looks great. Yeah, it definitely looks like. Oh, it looks like a bit of a fixer upper. Yeah, she's a bit of a fixer-upper. 
We got a couple of bugs. I also feel like I need to take out some of these objects. Like, yeah, I don't, I don't think, I think it has too many things in it, but it's looking good. I think we got, okay, wait, wasn't there like a, just a bunch of junk that was from the new pack? Werewolves. I feel like we could use some werewolves junk in here. Just to make it look a little more shabby. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Remix. Thank you, Grimster. Uh, there should be a piano though, since so she loves music. Well, we'll get one at some point. But right now the point is that there's no, there's not really a lot of stuff that she actually like it's not it's not a good house. It's not well taken care of. It's it's a bit in shambles. Okay, we got it. We got to delete that and put this guy in there. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is great. This is great. Because the point is not really to suffer and not have bathrooms and stuff. The point is that we have to like get enough money to sell all this stuff and redecorate. We'll just sell all of the, this bonus stuff on the walls. That's expensive. We don't need that. All right, let's double check. Yeah, I think we're getting most of the stuff out that like would be good to have. We're just like, oops. Yeah. Great. Mm, we don't need that. Okay. Cool. Yeah, this is fun. I like it. I don't want that. It's off the grid at first. Ooh, that could be interesting. All right, yeah, what lo we have creepy crawlies and grody right now. Ooh, no, I don't want the grody. That one, that one's so annoying. Okay, what should, what plot challenges should we have? Off the grid would be hard. I don't know how we're gonna do that. Okay, a lot of you guys are like, start with off the grid. All right, we'll start off the grid. Uh, is anything else? Why does she have two beds? This is, I don't know. There are just, we're two in there. I guess we'll just, we can delete one. I feel like we could just have like a... I think this was a family home. Like, I think this was her grandfather's or grandmother's home and it got left to her. And then she got fired or laid off for some stupid reason. Or, or maybe she's just here to like fix up the house or something, I don't know. I haven't decided yet. I'm thinking, okay, I'm thinking what's the plot. So I'm thinking, so she got her heart broken a long time ago. Um, I don't think she lost her job. I think she still has her job, but she inherited this house from her grandparent. And, um, so her goal is to kind of be back here and sell it. But unfortunately it looks terrible. So in order to sell this house, she's going to have to scavenge and sell things and fix it up. And then once we fix it up, we could sell it. But then by the time she fixes it up, she doesn't want to sell it. She moves here. So that's my, yeah, that's my my thing, I think, right now. What's her job anyway? I think she's a lawyer, but she's on a vacation right now. She's like on, I think maybe they forced her into a sabbatical or something. So she's not going to go to work right now. Um, we're not going to start out with money, by the way. I think she spent most of her money on the ticket here. So we're going to start with no money. She's only in town to fix it up and sell it. Um... Yeah, so we're gonna have to... Okay, we're off the grid, so this is gonna be a struggle. All right, well, welcome to your home. It looks like this. But we're gonna make it into a majestic Christmas wonderland. Just you wait and see. All right, there she is. She's, oh my God. Wait, change out of your out. change into your other outfit though. I want her in her other Christmas outfit. There we go. She shows up like this. She's like, are you kidding me? Look at her face. She's like, this is, are you kidding me? This is the house. This is the house. 
that I'm supposed to sell? It looks terrible. It looks terrible. It's on this. It's right next to a freeway. No one's going to want to buy this. All right. So let's go. All right. She has no monies. No monies. More pro lots of problems. We got 30 minutes. Oh, also, we got this back from the shed in the back, which is very cute. Okay, where are you going? Oh my gosh. She's gonna have a rude introduction to a dog? Oh no. You guys are gonna fall in love with this dog, and this dog is gonna be our dog. I'm, I swear. Swata, Bima, Why would you Seneca do a rude Belinda introduction, Grinia. by the way? Is it a stray? It is a stray. She's like, get away, dog. I don't wanna deal with you, Blue. No, Noelle just became uh, acquaintances with Blue the dog. She's like, why is this dog hounding me? Oh, sure. Not even $100 for food. <laughs> well, we'll I, I honestly, oh my God, she's still talking with this dog. Stop it, Noelle. Don't get into that dog yet. We're not there at the story. We need you to like go fishing or something. We got to get money. Okay, where, where do we get money? Oh no. In winter, it might be kind of hard. We might have to go to another location. I was hoping that we could just scrounge around. Oh my God, Meredith Roswell, we don't want to go to that. What is over here? What's this? Let's go dig there. Let's hope there's some gems or something. Oh my God, there's another dog. Olive, <laughs> the stray. Poor pupper. I knew you guys would all be like, adopt blue. It was just the first dog we saw. There was another stray right next to it. That looked like a husky. Dre out in the cold, so sad. They all need homes. No, she's a businesswoman. She's not here to adopt dogs. She's here to fix up this home and get out of here before Christmas, the worst holiday. She hates it. She will not adopt a dog. She can't put down roots. Don't be ridiculous. She's got to get back to the big city and her big city job. Uh, Seneca Yemf. She can't dig that up. Oh my God, look, this Yorkie's even following her. Emma, stay away. Oh my God, no, my heart is gonna break for this Yorkie though. I can't, I need to introduce myself to Emma. Uh, my first my first dog, uh, my, actually my second dog oh. from childhood oh. was a Yorkie. <laughs> I can't. Blue is the love interest dog? No, blue is blue is a stray, but I guess you guys could, could um, make the love interest and I can try to get that blue to be owned by the love interest. Okay, there's literally nothing to get here. Also, everyone say hi to some Guru Ninja. What's up, Veronica Gillo? Welcome to Twitch. Okay, there's literally, oh wait, there's fishing. Get over here, go gather some water. Go gather some water. I don't think we can go fish, but we are off the grid, so we need we need water. Megan, thank you for the bits. Brandy Boo, thank you so much for two months. She's just out here like, I am, I don't know what I thought I was rolling into, but this is bad. This is very, very bad. Is dumpster diving available in winter? I hope so. I might like buy a dumpster. I might sell some objects to buy a dumpster and put it outside her house. Or maybe we'll put a, we can't go fishing. It's too cold for fishing. Oh my God. Okay, where can we go? Let's try to travel somewhere. Let's travel somewhere. Near... We're not bringing Emma and Blue, okay? We're not putting down. The cold heart of this house flipper can only be thawed by the warm love of the strays. Now that is a holiday tale. Also, hi, Kelsey. That is the tale, but we're not at that part of the story yet. Okay, she right now she's like, no, I couldn't possibly. But then those dogs might just keep coming around and she might go, well. All right, where can we dumpster dive? This is kind of, this is bringing her low going to dumpster dive. I guess we can go but into the bar, the Salty Paws Saloon. Maybe that, that will have a dumpster. I will add a dumpster. <laughs> like a dumpster to remove all the broken down house items. Oh. That's pretty smart. What the old grandma cupcake machine? Oh, grandma's old cupcake machine. That would be pretty flippin' funny, actually. Maybe we will have to do that. We'll buy money. We'll get enough money to to, to get... Maybe it's in the in the garage and we need to get fixed up again. So we need to get enough money to buy grandma's old cupcake machine. And then, and then we'll be able, can we, can we, we can't fish here either. Flip in winter. All right, hold on, which by the way, I need to, 
I think it's game pack settings. No. Gameplay. How do I change? Is, is it other under? I wanted to like change the, oh, environment. Here we go. Seasons. Okay. Season length. I want the season to be long. I want us to be in snowy, snowy time all the time. So that's why I changed the season to be super long. Cause this is going to be Christmas until, until I say so. All right. It's going to be Christmas until I say so. All right. Let's add a dumpster onto this lot so that she can kind of grab some stuff. Okay, there's not a lot of room to add dumpsters on this lot. They, they really said, uh, this this lot is jam-packed. That's okay, I'm gonna delete this outdoor little area here. None of that. We'll just add a dumpster. Perfect. It's a dumpster out back. And she's just gonna go, I wonder if there's anything good in here I can use to fix it up. That's what we're gonna have to do. But first, we might go in. Oh, look, it's Mortimer Goth. Well, he's not a local. This, and is this Paka? This is Paka, also not really a local. Let's grab some chips. She's like, oh, I'm here at the local. I want this to be Christmas themed. I need to give a book. I want to make over the whole town to be Christmassy. Christmas forever, exactly. Winter apocalypse. Let's do winter, or like holiday, holiday. Is there holiday items? Holiday. I'm just gonna look up holiday. We're gonna put in like a Christmas tree and stuff in this bar. I mean, it, it honestly suits. This is great. We're gonna put it, we're gonna put all the decorations in the, in the bar. This is gonna be good. Amazing. Yes, this whole town is decked out. These halls are decked, okay? The halls are decked for Christmas in this town. Got the little little uh, candy cane men. That's not what they're called. Put this out in the front. Boom, boom. Now we got a we got a small town on Christmas, and she's uncomfortable. Whoa. Because ah, my eyes. She's seeing an unattractive sim. Who is it? Who is the unattractive sim? I gotta know. I gotta know who you hate. Is it Mortimer Goth? I want to see. I want to see her scan the room. I just, I, I don't know who the unattractive sim is, but that's hilarious. So much fun to see the decorations. Well, sim Ray, it is so much fun. Look at all these decorations. It honestly was so easy to do. To pop these in here. Fruk. Just an egg long as Lanaga. I hate that they always get rid of their things. Grab more chips. Who's this? Melee. None of these are locals here. Okay, here's your chips. Stop eating them really fast. Just really quick, stop eating them. Just really quick. Thank you. I gotta put it in the dumpster. It's very important that we put it in the dumpster so that we can start dumpster diving. Noelle has really brought low to go dumpster diving. <laughs> I'm gonna guess it's Mortimer that she's like, God, my eyes, so, so hideous. Maybe Mortimer looks a little like her boss. She's like not into it. The bootleg Gomez Adams. <laughs> they're from Salamity, but this is Brindleton Bay. I know, that's why I'm like, I don't think they're all locals, but they're, you guys will make the locals. I hope Ooh, you guys are making some out. right now. Did we get anything? We got a in outdoor lounger. Amazing. We'll dive again. She's like, I hate this. This birdie, this dirty birdie may have found some amazing treasures, but she will can't help but taste a tinge of regret. She does not like this. Oh my God, someone's gonna catch her. Raj. Raj is gonna catch her outside in the dumpster. Get out, get out before he comes. Oh God, oh God, this Raj man is like, um, excuse me? Olaba. Hi, why would you say hi to me? Oh. Okay, okay, Raj. Can you leave me alone? Ganesh. I, I was trying to no, dumpster no, dive, Mephisto. Raj. I don't want to hear about your holiday spirit, Raj. Loonies, Gelsey, Nepa. Seven A. Oh. No, Raj. Jiffa. <laughs> You're already working on someone. I can't see to see everyone. What's the hashtag for the Simpsons? Hashtag Kelsey Triple Christmas. Blue. 
Oh, there's no more Renzi. deals. Love. Dang it. <gasps> but look who decided to rock up. It's Flippin' Yoshi Ito. Gr uh, granted, he is a teen right now, and she is a, an adult. So they're not meant to be in this one, but guys, I think he just stalks me. I don't know what it is. Yoshi Ito is always. But oh my god, a baker in a bakery cafe. I do feel like she could start up like an accidental bakery. That would be really cute. I think she should. She should end up yeah, doing I'm a baking. Tanabe. Okay, Kiyoshi, get out of here. Y'all are embarrassing me. Embarrassing me. I was trying to just sell objects here and get money. And you all are, oh my god, there's a celebrity here. Great. Oh, oh, fantastic. Oh, oh, oh. Carrie's on her grandmother's cafe. Exactly. Okay, well, this is great. This is great. Oh, wait. I think we might be able to fish now. Is it cold? Is it warmer? Yes! We can fish together with. You know what, Raj? Why don't you teach me how to fish? Maybe Raj just wanted, wanted to teach her how to fish. And that's why. Please don't tell me it's too cold, Sims. Nope, she's waiting for a drink. All right, you're gonna spend all 20 simoleons that I just got on a drink? Noelle's like, I need a drink after seeing that terrible fixer upper home. I got a white, I got, I've got a glass of white wine, which I think, I don't know, maybe. Excuse me, did Judith Ward just steal my drink? I'm pretty sure I ordered that drink for myself. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. And Judith Ward just drank my drink. Screw you, Judith. Get out. You trash what? human. Speaking of trash. Okay, you know what? You two need to go. I'm trying to dive for deals here. Classic Judith. Sell the autograph. Ooh, wait. You're right. You're right. Judith owes me one. Judith, get that here. Judith, can I have an autograph? Judith, please. Can I can I please have an autograph? Judith! 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 Ma'am! You sort of like Phoebe Buffay for a second, you know? I grew up with Phoebe Buffay, so she's probably a large part of my personality, as is Rachel Green. She said no! You drank my wine and then you say no? I'm gonna ask again. I'm gonna ask again until you say yes, Judith. <laughs> Not a good look on you. Oh, she said yes this time. I asked twice and she said, that that's just goes to show. Sometimes you gotta ask twice. Sometimes it's fine. Are these lots on the gallery? This is, this is just comes with the world. All right, let's, uh, let's get it appraised. She's like calling up her big city contacts. Like, hey, I just got a an autograph that I need a praise. Do you know some people who could uh, tell me this is legitimate? Ooh, it's for $400. Boom, that's gonna be good. $400, baby. That's right, that's what you get, Judith Ward. Can we ask for another autograph? We're gonna just do keep doing it. Judith, come back. I would like to sell more of your autograph. Maybe she's like a, a local celebrity or a celebrity that used to live in this small town. That is not how you say Judith. Okay, potato tomato, I guess. That's how I say Judith. I let you guys correct me most of the time, but on this one, I will not budge. Judith Ward getting paparazzi in the bathroom. She said no. Well, Judith, I'm gonna keep bugging you until you give me one. <laughs> We're acting like her biggest fan. We are not. Oh. In my last Let's Play, Kiyoshi ended up marrying Judith Ward by his own choice. Terrifying. We're going to ask her in the toilet. Judith cannot get away from us. Judith! Judith, give me, a, give me an autograph again, please. She's going to do a selfie with me. Maybe we can sell that. Hey, Judith! Will you take a photto with me? Davishi? Let me say boobs. Judith's yeah. like, oh, lady, oh, you boobs. literally followed me into the bathroom. No, I don't want to give you an autograph. Hungaloy of Oh. Please! 
Why also oh, didn't I get any oh, photos? Oh, Mary and I. Oh, but <laughs> she lets me hug her. So she's so probably like, you already so got an autograph. Yeah. Stop asking. I'm like, girl, I don't care. I want more. Angeloya Pipamoy. Oh, oh Penosa. Yay! She said yes <gasps> again. <gasps> You know what? <laughs> this girl is oh, an opportunist. Noelle's like, I don't want to dumpster dive, okay? I'm gonna hound celebrities until they give me things. This is how you get a restraining order. Well, that's okay. Let's get it appraised. Bye, Make Judith. Oh, that body. sassy little walk. Jessine. She walks Lombic. away. No oops. Our girl Noelle won't take no for an answer. It's like, I do not want to sleep on that bed tonight, okay? I refuse to sleep on that bed. I want a nice bed. Okay. We've got a bit of money. Maybe we can go home. Ooh, look at the little nice little fireplace. That's such a nice little area to enjoy. What other things could we do around here? In this nice little... Look at this little village area. This is 100% a Hallmark Christmas movie. Waiting to happen. Sometimes you gotta ask the right. <laughs> All right, so she's going back home. Goodbye, Judith. Thank you for the money. <laughs> need some Christmas decor. I know the exteriors of all these locations do, do need some Christmas decor. Look at her running through this little town. All the way back to her home. I think her home's back this way. I don't know where though. It's somewhere in that area. Don't worry about it. Speaking of things not to worry about, thank you so much, Sophia, for your patience and giving Chewy a treat. And or Orchidius Andrea, thank you so much for giving a Chewy a treat. He is in the lap of luxury, my dog. Look at this man. Look at this young man. He straight up looks like he is being fed grapes. <laughs> he looks like he's like one of those, <laughs> like those Greek gods getting fed grapes while he lounges. Here's one from Sophia. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, you're doing amazing, sweetie Maddie girl. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Corgi, thank you for the dab. And Caitlin, thank you so much for requesting a remix. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. We're gonna get a brand new bed because this one looks crap. And we're high maintenance, so I think she'd invest in a bed first. Yes, she is. Uh, ooh, this one's got a discomfort relief. We gotta at least have like this kind of the butt. I want one that looks kind of Christmassy. Isn't there this one that has like the plaid? I just feel like a little Christmassy red bed. It's like maybe she could only find ones with like a Christmassy pattern on. And she was like, great. I guess this beats sleeping on whatever that was. They're so rustic though. Ooh, this one's kind of cute. It's a thousand. That would be all our money that we just got, but it would look so cute. I don't care. I'm gonna spend it all on the red plaid bed. Like an idiot. Yeah, that's me. Spend it all on the bed. <laughs> oh, we get, we get to sell the dumpster stuff. That's right. Boom, baby, we got a couple things from the dumpster. Okay, great. All right, so we got a nice bed. What else would she want to upgrade in the house? Ooh, this kitchen looks pretty bad. Um, oh, look at that. Okay, um, maybe the flooring. I feel like she'd want to rip out the carpet, but that'd be a whole other thing. Maybe the shower, the shower might be good. I mean, this isn't a bad shower, but it's not great. Oh, I hate the tile in here. Shower. 
Bathroom. Okay, we'll do it in the bath. We'll do it in the bathroom. We'll go in the bathroom. Are there any like off the grid things that we could get? Let's see any off the grid things. Cause we're off the grid right now. Mm -hmm. um, um, uh, change the tile. The tile is pretty gross. I agree. I feel like we'll have to maybe like do a thing where we rip out, change all the flooring. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll. Maybe, oh, maybe we should buy some off-the-grid lights. That's a good idea, actually. Let's get some off-the-grid lights in here. Okay. We'll put, like, one of these lanterns in there. <laughs> this is perfect. Oh, my gosh. Yes, this is funny. She spends all her money on off-the-grid lights to, like, light the bathrooms and stuff. Oh, my gosh. This is pretty funny just so she can see her way around the house. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> okay, um, is there any other lights that we could use that are kind of not so bad? Okay, this one, we'll put this on the like table here. We'll put that on, this looks very Christmassy. Okay, oh, we only have 400. <laughs> Dollars left, no. Oh, should we put a dumpster on the lot? I feel like we should try to buy a dumpster. We also talked about trying to get the cupcake thing going. Where's the dumpster? Okay, the dumpster's too much money. Cupcake. Where was the cupcake maker? Dang it, that's a thousand simoleons. Why did no one tell me? Okay, yeah, I guess maybe we should start selling the cobwebs, except for there are zero dollars. Okay, what else could we do? We sell this clothes. Okay, the pile of laundry is 40 simoleons, so maybe she sold some of the laundry that's sitting around in the house. She brought it to a resell place. Is there anything else that we can sell? What is this? Is this coal? Freaking a lump of coal. Santa hates her. <laughs> Santa hates her, it's canon. The rug, we could sell the rug. Perfect, okay, let's, let's uh, do the dumpster first. And then after the, no, I still don't have enough money. Maybe we'll sell the books. Get these books out of here, perfect. We got a dumpster on the lot. She, she brought it in to take care of all this crap furniture. And after we got the dumpster, maybe we can start deleting some of these like cobwebs and stuff like she'll clean, clean up. Even though technically the cobwebs are zero dollars. So it doesn't do anything. But she's gonna do a little cleaning. That was four dollars, are you kidding? It's funny to me that some of this is four dollars. Okay, what about... Okay, well, that, that'll be different when we do the walls. I feel like the walls will be a different day. Today we're just doing cobwebs. There we go. We'll grab some of these cobwebs up here. Slowly but surely we'll fix this house. Yeah. Okay, well, we got 65 simoleons. She's mad. Irrational hatred for the sun. She's like, get me out of the sun. It's too bright outside and I forgot my designer sunglasses. Ugh. Can she dumpster drive in her own dumpster? That's a great question. I don't know. We're going to find out. Let's like cook something. Cook. She doesn't know how to cook. Oh my God. We can't cook anything because we don't have any. S we don't have any energy in the house. We don't have any lights on. Oh my gosh. I forgot. She's just overstimulated. Agree. Oof. Oh, we, we missed one of the cobwebs right here. I think I like that I missed one. She's trying her best. Poor Bean. She's very mad. I'm excited for our um our welcome welcome home people oh, to come by. Oh no! Look at her shouting her forbidden words. She's having a terrible day. This is perfect to plot. 
Thank you, Caitlin, for the Not remix. Tawny. Cuckoo oh, Banana Rama, thank you so much for the oh. save, please. I love her being so grumpy as she's making this salad. It is absolutely hilarious. Um, Jay Hondel, Hondel, thank you so much for the deck. Uh, Jets, you're doing amazing, sweetie. Hope you're having a good time. And Charlene, you're doing amazing, sweetie. Thank you so much for tuning in. Oh my God, she doesn't like cooking. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. <laughs> she hates cooking. <laughs> Do they ever get power? So I think we'd have to like save up for a generator, oh, no, but I think at a certain point we'll just, when we have enough money, we'll turn uh, the power on. Yeah. If you get off the grid appliances, you could cook. That's also true. Hmm. Who falls in love with a chef then? Oh, that is so cute. All right. Oh my God, it's terrible. It's the most disgusting salad I think I've ever seen in my life. Eat it. It's funny. And then after that, I'll have a bowl to put in our dumpster and we can see if we dumpster dive. We're doing a Christmas LP and the lot is off the grid. It is true. This is my dog, Chewy. Chewy, say hi. Very good boy. He moved his head. That is a, as good of a high as we're gonna get. A Christmas chef. Oh, she hated it. Did you see her cringing? That is so funny. All right. Put it in our dumpster. We can still dumpster dive on our own lot. This is brilliant. We don't even oh. have to leave. Sell the ceiling lights. Oh, that's a good idea. We'll probably do that next. She can marry a chef. She wants to be a baker and they open a bakery or restaurant. That's cute. She's so angry. Oh my gosh. She hated bad wow. aftertaste. Needs amusement. She's had no, no fun today. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, she's not out. having a good time. Oh, she found go. Mary Potter's potted uh, plant in the dumpster. Yeah. Great, we found a plant. Let's see if it's cute. It's 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 okay. It's not my favorite. Let's sell it. We didn't make that much money. Um, are there any ceiling lights? I don't think there are ceiling lights. I think it's just these sconces that are not great. Um, we could sell this little TV or sell this little table. Maybe we'll sell this little table. We need to sell, we could just sell all the furniture to see if we can make enough money to buy the cupcake thing. Get, sell these industrial sinks. Also, wait, wait, in the back. It's a flower arranging. Maybe she should flower arrange. It's already here. Should we do the cupcake thing or should I try to flower arrange? Then I could just put all this stuff back. And we wouldn't have to do it. It's already there. A potted plant? Perry a potted plant. Hilarious. Do the flowers? Let's do the flowers for a minute. Maybe her grandmother liked doing the flowers over here. It's kind of already here, so it's kind of like kismet. We'll make some like holly, random holly arrangements. Yeah, let's try that. She's probably gonna hate it. We can try both. Do you guys want to do a poll maybe to see if she, we want to do flowers or do the cupcakes? Flowers, but it's perpetually winter, so don't think grows. This is fair. Which uh, flowers uh, uh, have garb. But I love that she has a little shed. It's kind of cute. Oh. She's sneezing on the flowers. She's like, maybe if I make these, I can sell them. Yeah. Ooh, we're gonna have you sell them, girlie. Maybe we'll have you make a bunch of them and try to sell them on a little like Ooh. stand. Baking is more Christmassy. She's making a holly arrangement and her Aww. name is, or was gonna be Holly. Well, her name is Noelle, but yeah. There are fake flowers. She can give people cupcakes, it's true. Okay, you guys are more into the cupcakes. That's okay, we can do a little bit of both. Maybe we'll maybe we'll do the flowers until we make enough money to, to get the cupcake thing. Cupcake in the shed. I don't know if that works for me. Oh. Every Hallmark Christmas movie has a bakery. Oh. You're not wrong. Arfania, Zarzuya. I was thinking we could be a little bit original. Oh. 
But I don't think she might be into the florists. Gourmet fruit cakes. Cupcakes and maybe uh, later she can run a bake sale for, to save the town. Um, I think a little bit of both. I think we'll do the flowers until we can get the cupcake machine. Well, I think that'll be the best the best option here. Okay, Ooh. great. How, how is it? It's poor quality. Fantastic. Why don't you go oh, to the bathroom? Shit, it's a boy. She's so unhappy. All right, sweetie, why don't you go take a little angry poop? Maybe we'll watch a bit of TV because you're just not having a good time. Take a nice quick and tempid Actually, take a cold shower. Cool off a little bit. You're angry as heck for no reason. Go cool off in the cold shower. She's a psychopath taking a cold shower in, in the winter. But it's, I guess, helping her anger go down. Warmish wash. Oh, we can't watch anything. Because we don't have any energy. Never mind. I don't know how she's going to have any fun. Can we read a book? Are these books readable? Nope. How is she supposed to have fun? She likes to sing. We'll sing. We'll sing. I forgot she likes to sing. She can also listen to her headphones. Okay, let's 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 practice singing. You love to sing. You love to sing. <laughs> Will the cupcake machine even work off the grid? That's a great question. It might not. Is this making your fun go up? It is. This is why she does it in the bathroom where no one can hear her. La, 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 oh, Noel. La, la, you're doing la, amazing, la, sweetie. La, la, Speaking of people doing amazing, sweetie, Cindy, you're doing amazing, sweetie. Waffle. Thank you so much for tuning in. Do, do. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. Oh. <clears throat> <clears throat> yep. La 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 dee dee dee. Oh. oh no. La, 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 the D D D was funny. La, okay, let's try to go make one more flower arrangement before we call it a day. Hopefully, she's still very tense from the, sh the after the grid shower. I'm sorry, okay? I know it's not up to your high standards. Noelle. Look at her stank face. I love it. It's just so perfect for the challenge. But she's trying, okay? She's a hard worker. She's like, I'm gonna make this work. I want her to hear her voice in the remix. Uh, uh, We're all gonna pretend this singing face didn't happen. She just has a naturally beautiful singing voice. Yeah, maybe she just hasn't sung in a long time. Oh. Putting in that nice little holly bit. Pardue? Pardue, uh, I don't know. Yep. Huh. All right, she's gonna add all the holly onto there. And then we're gonna, is this one? Nope, it's still poor. Flower arranging, I've never fully quite grasped, but she's gonna go inside to her fancy new bed that she Earned through dumpster diving. We're very proud of you, Noelle, for earning that through dumpster diving. I know it was, it took a lot of your ego, but honestly, the, the, the layout of this house is pretty cute. I like it. And she's gonna go to bed. And there she has it. She's in bed. Oh no. Clothing pile. Do laundry. We can't do any laundry because there's this clothing thing out here so that means that we're gonna have laundry piles oh no i might delete that at some point oh and she's gonna get wake up to be attacked by bats <laughs> Noelle! <gasps> Knick. she's like oh god oh god i'm being attacked by bats she's like are you kidding me <laughs> are you kidding me Absolutely hilarious. She is livid, but she wants to start a new relationship. 
interesting. Maybe she just wants a little fling. She's like, maybe, maybe I can have a fling while I'm here. Who knows? But I'm going to leave this one here. Thank you guys so much for um, creating Noelle with me and starting off her challenge. I'm so excited to see all of your guys' characters. In the next one on Sunday, we'll pick out some love interests, some like local characters around the town. Just think Gilmore Girls. Like the, I want the Miss Patty. You know, I want the Luke Danes. I want them all. I want the Kirk who's like an awkward, I want all of the fun little characters and I'm gonna put them, I'm gonna move all the characters out of this world, move all your characters in next time so we can go around introducing ourselves to all of the colorful characters that you guys create for my story. Um, and hopefully we'll start our baking in the next one. Hashtag is hashtag Kelsey Christmas. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Oh, actually, you know what? Now that I'm thinking about it, we got raided so many times. Let's raid someone. Let's Let's share in this holiday spirit. Now that I'm thinking about it, let's go see who's on. That's streaming right now. Oh, Dr. Gluon is playing Sims. I bet he's doing some fun things. Let's let's go raid Dr. Gluon. Tell Dr. Gluon I say hi. It's been a minute since I've seen him. Make sure to use hashtag Kelsey Christmas for all your uploads. If you forget, I'll let you know at the beginning of next episode, and you could probably re-upload it with that hashtag, like right before I get started. All right, we're going to raid now. Have a really good one, guys. Love you.